Hello again, and welcome back to Paul's Wine Reviews, the Broken Arm Edition. Quickly, I am 31 years old, and I went to the skate park for the first time in mm, 12 years, and I fell and it broke. Moving on into the video, just to remind you how this thing works, every week I'll open a new bottle of wine and I'll give it a grade based off of the smell, the color, and how the wine tastes. So without further ado, let's get into today's selection. Today we have a Sauvignon Blanc from New Zealand. Now this one is called Small and Small. The winemakers, Bill and Claudia Small, are fairly new to the game in terms of winemaking, with their first vintage being produced in the year 2010. Now, this particular bottle comes from an area in New Zealand called the Marlborough region, and I'll go ahead and put a map up right now. And the winemakers claim that this is refreshing and bright, and we will see what 12 or 13 years worth of winemaking can produce from such a small area at the bottom of the world. Let's get into the next part of the video. And once again, it is time for the famous bottle open challenge. We have a twist off today, but I'm injured, so I will be forced to open this with one hand, and that's the challenge. My goal is still to get it under that 15 second benchmark. It's been kind of elusive recently, so we'll see how this goes. And if I fail, should I fail, I will be forced to drink the wine with my injured arm, and that wouldn't be good for anybody. Price point on this bottle, I picked this one up on NakedWines.com for an astounding $14.99. With that out of the way, let's begin when I say so. Begin! Let's go. And actually, holy crap, this is a lot harder with one arm than you think. You need to like, oh, 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 I got it. I got it. Did you hear it? Did you hear it? I Boom, stop the timer. Okay, that was... I was a little nervous at first, but I think we got it. I got that off faster than the dress on prom night. Here we are on to the smelling portion of the video. Let me go ahead and get this into the glass and see what we can suss out. God, I can smell it from here already. Okay, let's go ahead and see what we can smell. This smells really good actually it smells very crisp very clean it smells like it's gonna be pretty perfect for summer if i do say so myself and as far as the notes that are coming through it's a lot of fruit forward and more specifically i'm getting peach uh out of this sing it jack black peaches 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 i'm gonna make you mad with that out of the way no it seriously smells really good i am looking forward to this one so moving on to the next portion of the video on to the color portion of the video let's go ahead and get it up into the light and this looks really great actually it looks clean it looks crisp, it's very see-through, it's light and airy, and the alcohol lines are fairly smooth. They're smooth as butter, actually. And this is 12.5% alcohol by volume, so it's fairly light, and it should make for a really pleasant drinking experience. Overall, the color gets a pass from me. Here we are at the tasting portion of the video. Let's go ahead and get it down the gullet and see what we can think. Ooh, this is good. It's nice and dry with a little bit of fruit flavor coming through and honestly a pinch too much acidity, but I suppose that's what you get for reviewing a wine from New Zealand. They would make something that tastes like a kiwi. Uh, Overall, I think it's really good though. I do give it a pass. And that is going to do it for this episode of Paul's Wine Reviews. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like the video if you haven't already and subscribe for more wine related content. I really liked Small and Small Vineyards from New Zealand. It's a little dry, it's a little fruity, it's a very acidic, and I recommend you drink this with a nice bowl of fruit, maybe some pineapple or hey, even a kiwi in there. Thank you so much for watching, and we will see you next time. Cheers. Drink this with a nice